Hello, my name is Benjamin Hart. I'm an American attorney and the managing director of Integrity Legal here in Bangkok, Thailand. In this video today, we're going to be just dis discussing probate and wills um, with specific em emphasis on foreigners who um, are seeking inheritance of Thai real estate. So let's preface this by stating, and this has gone into at length in other uh, videos on this channel, in the Kingdom of Thailand, there are specific restrictions for foreigners uh, which specifically preclude them from being able to own property here in the Kingdom of Thailand. What, what are we talking about? Basically land, real estate, uh, specifically. Now, it may be possible to own things like structures on land, uh, things like condominiums in Thailand under specific instances, and it's also possible to obtain things like use of rights and long-term leases. But specifically, uh, land ownership is, is heavily, heavily restricted. Now, a foreign national can own land in Thailand if, I believe, it's signed off by the Minister of the Interior, and only under a narrow subset of circumstances can that happen. So, as a practical matter, uh, land ownership by a foreign national is probably not going to be possible, which brings us which brings us to the topic of this video, which is this. What about a situation where you've got a foreign national married to a Thai national, uh, the Thai national, let's say it's the Thai wife, has owned a house in her name, um, and maybe through usage of various instruments in order to, sort, to somewhat shore up the foreign national's uh, legal standing, you have a lease back to the foreign national, etc. But now this Thai national is deceased. And the question becomes, can the foreign national spouse inherit in the same manner as, as a Thai national spouse would under similar circumstances? The short answer is no. Uh, there are rules regarding this, um, the specifics of which I would leave to my Thai colleagues here at the firm. But that being said, um, just sort of an overview as I've discussed it with them and, uh, and I'm able to provide sort of at least some basic insight into this is basically there's a rule which stipulates from the closing of the probate estate, uh, there's a statutorily prescribed period of time, I believe it's 90 days, uh, in which the foreign national spouse who inherited the property needs to go ahead and sell the property, is compelled to sell the property, uh, in, and thereafter enjoy the benefits of the sale, but cannot uh, own the property as a result of inheritance. Um, it's interesting, uh, most folks who have been party to land ownership or let, let's say purchase of land here in Thailand where the Thai spouse, uh, usually female, has gone ahead and put land in her name using uh, the funds of a foreign national. In most of those cases at the uh, land office, the foreign national will be required to sign a document which stipulates that not only are they aware of the purchase, but that they you know, forego and understand that they're waiving any rights to inheritance or ownership in the land. So it's rather explicit in the Thai language, this restriction on foreign ownership, uh, but uh, the inheritance is sometimes something of, a, of an issue. Um, in, in some cases, the courts will be willing to delay the closing of the probate so that the foreign spouse can go ahead and find a buyer or can find, in some cases, another family member to take over um, legal ownership of the property. Um, that's going to be very case specific, and I'm not going to go much more deeply into this because, again, this is really more for the Thai attorneys to discuss. But that being said, yeah, the, it's sort of possible to inherit Thai real estate, but it's under certain conditionalities that require and sort of preclude the type of enjoyment that most people associated that most people associate with um, normal inheritance.